your hand carry fire. If you can live in the life of righteousness, anybody that is sick, lay a hand on the person, the person will be healed. I don't know. Because when I started praying for you, I see the hand of God jamming his hand on your hand. If you can partner with God, your hands have carried the anointing of healing. Jubilee, if you partner with God, your hands have carried the anointing of healing. Whatsoever you lay it and declare, it shall be done. I am glad you see the water. As men that have the water, we pick it up. Let's pray for our water. The yoke of my child delay be broken. There shall be no barren. We don't welcome barrenness. We don't welcome miscarriages. We will not welcome any late marriages. No more delay. Satan, I say, park and go. Park and go. Barrenness, park and go. Park and go. Let marriage park and go. Back and miscarriage park and go. Park and go. I say park and go. Cancer park and go. Park and go. Park and go. Oh, park and go. Barrenness park and go. Sickness park and go. Park and go. Let marriage park and go. We say park and go. We need you. We don't need you in our midst. Park and go. You say, yes. who is that? Only if you are pregnant. You have been seeing blood since yesterday. Get water. Sister Olive gets water, so you're getting the water, lay your hands on your stomach. And I pray for you from the book of Exodus chapter 23-26. The Bible says that none shall suffer miscarriage of a barren in the land. I return the word of God back to him. I seal up the entrance of that threatened miscarriage. My father, my father, behold your daughter, Olive. Lord, I seal up that threatened miscarriage. She will not miscarry. I return your word back to you. Say, none shall suffer miscarriage or be barren in the land. Lord, behold your word. Behold your word. Behold your word. Behold your word. Let your word speak now. Behold your word. Let your word speak now. Behold your word, 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 we declare that no of our pregnant women will miscarry. None of our pregnant women will miscarry. Father, we return the word back to you. There shall be no barren in our midst. There shall be no parent in our midst. There shall be no miscarriage in our midst. No more late marriages in our midst. Let the word of God speak. No more sickness in our midst. I seal up that utterance of that miscarriage. You will not miscarry. You will not lose your baby. It's excess blood. It's excess blood. I call God Almighty, the Father and the Son of the Holy Spirit to take over. Every handwriting of miscarriage, I cancel them by the power in the name of Jesus. Only I pray every threatening miscarriage, handwriting of the enemy, projected to cause you to miscarry your baby by the power and authority above every other power. By the name of the Lord Jesus, I command you shall not miscarry your baby. I return the word of God back to him. He said that none shall suffer miscarriage in the book of Exodus 23, 26. Let the word of God speak now. Let altars of miscarriages bow. Let altars of barrenness bow. Altars of late marriages bow. Sicknesses bow. And I lift the altar of God Almighty on high. You will carry your babies to full time. You will deliver, save, and so shall it be. In the name of God the Father, 
and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. It is done. Congratulations. Male 